Okay, ladies and gentlemen, um, I want to show you guys a little bit about how to um, to think about reading these texts that that I give you. Um, there's a lot of words in here that are uh, not going to be clear to you when you read them, and that's okay. You don't actually need them. So when we read an article such as Leben's Mittel in Müll, which is the one that we did for our last quiz, we started off here with the with the title, and um, with the title I gave you guys that Müll meant the trash can, and so we wanted to make sure that we understood the title, that we understood um, that we understood exactly what that meant. So. We go on and we read the first paragraph. It says, Jedes Jahr werden Millionen Tonnen Lebensmittel in der EU verschwendet. I also told you that EU was the European Union. Das ist nicht nur teuer für die Verbraucher, sondern lässt auch weltweit die Lebensmittelpreise steigen. Die EU will etwas dagegen tun. All right, so you got a lot of stuff going on in there. But the first thing we see, um, you know the word werden, you know Jahr, you know, you should know Millionen, and you should be able to figure out Tonnen Lebensmittel. And your goal was to figure out this word Verschwendet. That was one of the vocabulary words that was asked for. Now you know that Müll means the trash can, so we have to think that it's something in that direction. But so far we've got year, will, millions, Tonnen, you should be able to figure out, means tons food so we've got millions of tons of food will something in the EU in the European Union das ist nicht nur teuer für die Verbraucher so now we've got some words here teuer you should remember from chapter 6 um, das ist nicht nur teuer that is not only expensive sondern lässt auch weltweit die Lebensmittelpreise steigen now we've got weltweit, worldwide, die Lebensmittelpreise. If you didn't know Preise, you should have been able to figure it out, although you should have known that Preise meant prices. So it's not only expensive, and then it's got, we, we're talking about worldwide prize, prices. Die EU will etwas dagegen tun. Now that, that dagegen might throw you off a little bit, but you don't actually need it. If we've got this part, die EU will etwas tun, the European Union wants to do something. And dagegen means about it or against it. So, we've got food that we're talking about. We know that it's going in the trash. So this is a problem we're talking about. Next paragraph. Nudeln vom Vortag, die niemand mehr essen will, oder abgelaufene Joghurts landen in Europa viel zu oft im Müll. Besonders viel Essen wird in Privathaushalten und im Einzelhandel weggeworfen. Das liegt vor allem daran, dass zu viel gekauft oder gekocht würde. Oft werden Lebensmittel aber auch falsch gelagert und dadurch schneller schlecht. Alright, so, now, we've got a few things going on. Nudeln vom Vortag. Noodles from for tag. For means before and tag from the day before. Die niemand mehr essen will. Oder abgelaufene Joghurts. So we've got Joghurts landen in Europa. Viel zu oft im Müll. Too oft, you should be able to figure out, means too often. So all these things, they land too often in the trash. Besonders viel Essen wird in Privathaushalten und im Einzelhandel weggeworfen. Now, that one could get tricky, but Privat, Privathaushalten, you should be able to guess, is private households. Privat, private, house, ho, house, halten, hold. Und im Einzelhandel weggeworfen. And even if you didn't know that, if you got weg and worfen, you should be able to, to guess because weg means away, worfen looks like werfen, so it is thrown away. So we've got viel Essen wird in Privathaushalten. So a lot of food gets thrown away in private households and in businesses. Das liegt vor allem daran, dass zu viel gekauft oder gekocht würde. 
All you need to know here is zu viel gekauft oder gekocht. So we've got zu viel, too much. Gekauft, don't really need to know the ge. Kauf means buy, so people buy too much or gekocht. Kocht means cook. They buy too much or they cook too much. Um, oft werden Lebensmittel aber auch falsch gelagert und dadurch schneller schlecht. And we, that, honestly, that sentence, it doesn't really help us too much. We don't need it. So we will, um, we can just ignore it. So, next paragraph. Die Verschwendung von Lebensmitteln beginnt jedoch bereits auf dem Feld. So, Verschwendung was a word that we needed to get. So, all this time we've been talking about um, food going in the trash. And so, Verschwendung means waste. The waste of food beginnt, begins, you don't need jedoch, auf dem Feld. If you can get that part of the sentence, you've got it. The wasting of food begins in the field. Selena Juhl, Gründerin der dänischen Stoppwasting Food Bewegung, sagt, wenn Gurken krumm oder Karotten zu klein sind oder färblich abweichen, werden sie entsorgt. All right, so this lady, Selena Juhl, um, the, the founder of this Danish Stop Wasting Food organization, says... Um, all we need, gherkin, you may remember, we've talked about it before, but if you don't, that's okay. Karotten zu klein. Basically, we're talking about food that does not meet our normal standards. Um, and then people just tend to get rid of them. Und das hat Folgen für die global, globale Ernährungssicherheit. Now, this is an interesting one. Folgen. You know the word folgt? So that has following effects für die globale Ernährungssicherheit. You should know Sicherheit. Sicher means safe. And so this has um, an effect on global safety. Now, I don't really expect you to get that part, but if you recognize Sicherheit, you might be able to get something from there. Du sagt, je mehr Essen verschwendet wird, desto höher liegen die weltweite Lebensmittelpreise. Now, I did ask you to get this je mehr and desto her. What you need from those sentences, je mehr essen. Now, you know mehr. Something more food wasted. Her sounds like higher than weltweiten Lebensmittelpreise. So, the more food gets wasted the higher the food prices worldwide. So, for the next paragraph, dieses Problem hat nun auch die Europäische Union erkannt. Sie will die Verschwendung von Lebensmitteln in den EU-Ländern bis zu 2025 um 50% reduzieren. So, we see dieses Problem the European Union. So basically, the European Union has this pro problem. They they see the pro problem. Sie will die Verschwendung von Lebensmitteln in den EU-Ländern bis 2025 um 50% reduzieren. So, when, because we know the word will, they want to reduce the waste of food in EU countries by 2025 by 50%. You've got all the pieces there, just put them together. Seit August 2012 finanziert sie deshalb das Projekt Fusions. So they started financing this project Fusions in August. Das versucht die Verbraucher für dieses Problem zu sensibilisieren. You don't need any of that. You can completely skip that sentence. Uh, und das ist auch nötig. Don't need that part. Laut Projektkoordinator Twain Timmermans werden 25 bis 30 Prozent der Produkte verschwendet. So, this Projektkoordinator, this person, says that 25 to 30 Prozent of products are wasted. 
für den menschlichen Verzehr gedacht sind. Don't need any part of that. Mehrere Millionen Tonnen. Now, if you answered 25 bis 30 Prozent or Millionen Tonnen, both of those were correct answers. Fusions will außerdem auf erfolgreiche Aktionen gegen die Verschwendung von Lebensmitteln aufmerksam machen. You don't need any of that. Eine gute Idee hatten zum Beispiel die Macher des Internetportals foodsharing.de. If you've got eine gute Idee, hat foodsharing.de, hier kann jeder Lebensmittel, die er nicht mehr essen will, verschenken oder gegen andere Lebensmittel tauschen, ohne dafür etwas bezahlen zu müssen. So hier kann Lebensmittel, so hier kann Food, die er nicht mehr essen will, so nicht mehr essen will, we've got want to eat, no more. Now notice we've got a comma D and our verb is often at the end. That So here we're saying, here can someone, um, who, here can, here somebody can do something with this food that he doesn't want to eat anymore, verschenken. And I asked you about this word verschenken, and I wanted to see if you could see any word in the word verschenken. And this was kind of a stretch, but um, some of you were able to do it really well. Schenken. That should look like a word that you recognize. That should very much look like the word geschenk. And what do we do with a geschenk? But we give it away. So here, if you have extra food that you don't want, you can give it away or gegen andere Lebensmittel tauschen, or you can trade it. I didn't expect you to that to understand that part. Ohne etwas bezahlen zu müssen, without having to pay for it. So, if you'll notice, when we highlighted here, There is less than 50% of this text that you needed to know in order to gain knowledge of all those questions that I asked you. Let's take a look. So, wasting of food, we talked about right here. Die Verschwendung von Lebensmitteln beginnt auf dem Feld. So, the wasting of food begins on the field. So, Hopefully you knew this was zu informieren. Um, and you could put here Verschwendung um, or anything like that. Um, was ist die Hauptidee dieses Texts? Um, as long as you're not starting with die Hauptidee ist. Wie, wo, wann, warum. Those are all not good ways to start. Instead, start with um, in Europa, something along these lines. In Der EU um, Leute verschwenden zu viel Lebensmittel. And if you didn't know that word verschwenden, you could say Leute werfen zu viel Lebensmittel in den Müll, um, werfen zu viel Lebensmittel weg, any of those would do, but I was just, that was all I was looking for. In der EU Leute verschwenden zu viel Lebensmittel. Technically it should say in der EU verschwenden Leute zu viel Lebensmittel, but I would take what we have here. So, Nummer 4. Die Verschwendung von Lebensmittel beginnt now, in the text, before sie im Supermarkt kommen. Now that we know that Verschwendung means waste, the wasting of uh, food begins before they even come to the supermarket. Now, I did not use the specific, um, I did not use the exact writing that was in the text, the exact word that was in the text, because I wanted you to understand what was in the text and show me that you could um, transfer that knowledge 
to new words. Nummer fünf, wenn man zu viel Lebensmittel verschwendet, so when people uh, waste too much food, ist das auch schlecht für Menschen in anderen Ländern. So this one comes from um, where we said that we talked about uh, the prices worldwide, worldwide rising. Nummer sechs, um, we said Millionen Tonnen. Or 25 bis 30 Prozent. Either one of those, um, if you had them in a complete sentence, that was better. So here, Verschwendung. Whoops. Here, Verschwendung. We were looking for waste or something along those lines. And then you had to tell me because food got thrown in the trash. Here can Lebensmittel, die er nicht mehr essen will, verschenken. Oder gegen andere Lebensmittel tauschen. So verschenken means give away. And a good way to explain, wie weißt du das? We had schenk, which should lead you to think about geschenk. And what do you do with a geschenk? You give it away. And again, here, je mehr, desto höher, the more food gets thrown away, the higher the prices worldwide. Um, so that would be something. I did um, kind of use this one as a bonus. This one got really, um, really complicated. So, zu viel Lebensmittel werden sowohl in Familien als auch von Supermärkten weggeworfen. Um, too much food um, is thrown away in families as well as in supermarkets. So, als auch, als auch, I was looking for as well as. Um, so, some I, I didn't, that was kind of a throwaway question where if you got it right, then um, I gave you points, but if you didn't get it right, right I didn't really use it. So, I hope this helps you uh, understand a little bit better how to think through some of the readings. Um, and we will be having readings um, not only on your final exam, but coming up fairly soon. So 